Welcome to the Hardline Beta First Impressions. Generally, I think this beta is better than the closed one I played around the end of E3 last year. And unlike the last beta, I'm playing this on both the PC and the PlayStation 4, rather than just the PC. Let's start with what you can see. The graphics. From where I'm sitting, barely a meter from my screen, the graphics on the PlayStation 4 look really good. The colors popped and there was a good level of detail. On the PC, the graphics looked strangely washed out to me, but I don't know if that was my screen at fault because it's not really noticeable in the video. Frame rates are solid and with capable hardware I managed an average of about 90 frames per second at full HD, fully maxed out settings. Visceral has given us three game modes to play with, Heist, Hotwire and Conquest. I've only played Heist and Hotwire so far, and so far I'll tell you this, I have had no idea what was going on in any of the games. I've never owned a Battlefield game before, so that might be why, but to be honest, the whole idea of a cops and robbers th theme seems like it should be a game mode in part of a bigger game, say uh, Battlefield 4. The whole idea to me seems like it may have been better as a DLC, because at this point, it doesn't feel like a full $60 game to me. Hotwire is probably my favourite game mode so far, but I think that's because I prefer to drive around in the vehicles rather than actually shooting other players. One of the cool things about Hotwire is driving around in the car whilst your teammate leans out the window and takes out enemies with their gun, or if you prefer to do it the other way around. Right now I've only had a few matches in Heist, but it did remind me of Sabotage in Call of Duty. Yes, I brought up Call of Duty. It does look like it could provide some great team-based gameplay in the finished product. One thing I didn't like was the time to kill, which is just too short, but if you've played Battlefield before, this probably isn't a problem for you. The connection was generally pretty solid, but in some of the later games I did have quite a bit of lag. Hopefully they'll be finished, they'll be dealt with by the release, and hopefully it was just my connection. The controls so far are very responsive if you're using a mouse and keyboard on PC and not a controller like I was trying to do. Yeah, don't don't do that. I haven't run into many bugs, which is great, but it, it there's something missing. Hardline doesn't quite pull me in. It doesn't give me that I must have this game in my life now kind of feeling. Of course this is a beta, so it could change. But right now, it doesn't leave me running to go and buy the full game. What did you think of the Hardline beta? Whether you loved it or hated it, leave a comment down below. Don't forget to catch me on Twitch if you don't want to miss my Hardline beta stream. This is Silo, signing out.